Friends, as a giver to St Mark's, it's important you know how we spend the money you entrust to us. You give as a church family member to both the running of St Mark's, but also in our work in the local community. These are the projected budget figures set in the spring of this year, and each budget holder is accountable for keeping to that budget. You'll see our tithe listed here. We always give and tithe 10% of the income we receive from all gifts to the church. Now, the reason it says 8% here is because this is the expenditure of a budget with a deficit. The reality is always by the end of the year, 10% of our income is given to charity. We give 10% to honour God, acknowledging that what has been entrusted to us is not ours, it is his. It goes to the work of all our mission partners. Utilities were set at 9% of our expenditure this year. We know that there will be at least £10,000 more to add to our figures as we come into the winter, so we know that it will be considerably more than 10%. Salaries are an important part of our expenditure as we pay a number of staff in order to facilitate the mission of St Mark's. It's important we use that phrasing because the staff of St Mark's aren't employed to do the mission, they do some of it, but to enable mission and to enable you to be released into mission. So you don't need to be helping um, too much with the administration of various things. Um, uh, we have the staff to be able to support all of that and do some of the planning to release you into what God's calling you to do. We couldn't run St Mark's as we do and as we currently are without all um, our uh, staff members, the outreach, the discipleship work, all of that. Um, and we're so grateful to all of you who come alongside the staff team. Or in fact, let me turn that around, who the staff team come alongside you. We thank you for all that you are giving um, of yourselves. Uh, there are various expenses required for the youth, children and clergy teams. However, these figures only represent the specific pots. There is a much wider and shared investment in children and youth represented in sundries and other cuts of this particular pie. So don't worry too much about those exact figures, um, but it gives you an idea of some of those specific pots. We now upkeep and maintain four buildings uh, which take 11% of our expenditure every year and there are other costs for the office the outreach it systems equipment and other smaller items represented in the remaining slices of the pie yes there's a pesky one called sundries if you've got particular questions you can ask verna um, about that but that's all our smaller things it and the things i've just listed the biggest expenditure by far is our parish share now for most churches this is most of um, their income goes on the parish share. For us at St Mark's, it's 44% of our expenditure um, and it's given to the church commissioners. It's both part of our commitment and membership to the Church of England. And it, half of it, half of that 44, so 22%, pays for you to have a vicar. I should say, and I want to say, that I don't receive even 11% of our expenditure directly into my pocket. However, it does, this 22%, provide for um, my salary, the vicarage, many of the legal structures that it takes to uh, maintain a full-time clergy person. The other 22% of our parish share goes toward the cost of ministry in smaller churches where they can't afford a vicar. It's part of our responsibility to the wider church um, as a larger church um, uh, in, uh, um, in a, quite a poor uh, diocese, in fact, the poorest in the country. Now, for the big headers, the cost of ministry last year was £233,853. And because of your generosity and a number of the grants that we ended uh, we had last year. We ended the year with no deficit and a small surplus. That was amazing. And I just want to thank everyone for your diligent giving. Um, the cost of ministry this year is uh, projected at £247,065. If we assume that there are 200 people who regularly give and worship with St Mark's across the month, um, that would make the personal cost of ministry at St Mark's £24 per week per adult. Basically, 
if every member of St Mark's gave £24 per week, we would break even by the end of 2023. Because we don't include a guesstimate figure for our vision and commitment gift day, there is a projected deficit of £53,395, which includes the £10,000 increase we expect to pay on our utilities across the church and centre. I hope that helps. Now let's get into um, commitment in general.